When first-year head coach Derek Williams arrived at Cleveland, he envisioned building his basketball program in the same mold as the town it represents. Cleveland is a strong community, a hard-working community, and you kind of want your team to, to filter into what's, what the town is. And so that was a big aspect of coming in and saying, look, this is what the fans want. This is what your town wants, and you're not representing that. And, and so that has been the hardest part of getting in and making sure that these kids work every minute, just like their families do. And that's been the biggest change with the basketball team is to getting them to be what the community is. Williams inherited a young roster with a freshman, two sophomores, and just three seniors in the Indians regular rotation. Each week we've gotten better. And when you're talking about my starting point guard's a freshman, my starting shooting guard is a sophomore that didn't play last year, and you start talking about bringing them into the fold, and then you have all these young guys that that really hadn't played, and now you're putting them in there with the chance and with the TJ, and you putting those guys in there, you're gonna expect some up and downs. It's just to a point where I have to step up, knowing that I can be the guy, and people are expecting me to lead, so I have to be able to step up and show people that we can do what people think we can't do. Cleveland's leader on the floor is junior wing Chance Brown. Brown averages better than a double-double, scoring 28 points and grabbing 12 rebounds a game. I really will, I like what we have going. Our coach, he's a really nice man, and I really like the way he came into my life, and he changed me a lot. And the player that I am now, I don't think I could be without him. The one thing that uh, I have been able to bring to him is, you know, one of the things he asked me was, you want me to be great every day? And I said, yeah, you have to be. So I think I've been a type of coach that comes in and just lets him know, hey, this ain't all about basketball. I am a life lesson guy. And so basketball is good, but it ain't gonna always be there. So what are you going to do? And, and, and you're gonna have to attack the basketball court just like you do with life. Cleveland got off to a good start with a 13 to four record. And as the season has progressed, the young Indian squad has grown and developed around Brown. Teams, they focus on him. So we have to prepare ourselves to be focused and help him out because we just don't want him to go out there and kill us. So, so we have to help him out and help the team win. Now the Indians have themselves in the thick of the district race and in position for a postseason bid. It means a lot because we haven't had anything in a long time. And we can finally get a banner on the wall or something like that. I think it's big. I, I don't think we've had a district championship or a district runner-up championship since the mid-90s. And I think it'd be big for the town. I think the town deserves it. And I think it'd be a beautiful thing. And, and if the kids can continue to work. Right now, we've been at this hill all year. It is just time to get to the top and, and, and go down the other side and see what's down there.